Good morning. This is the outfit for today. Today the bump is bumping, and this little cute thing is from Target. Okay. Oh, you look nice. <laughs> Where are you going with that? To the gym. Like that. All right, you guys, so we just made it to the gym. All right, guys, so we're inside waiting for the kids' zone. We're trying to check in right now. I do not want to get on this treadmill. I just want to let y'all know. She said 45 minutes. Oh, what she's talking about. There's no 45 minutes. The thing only said a couple of seconds, but... Guys, I am not working out. I don't want to work out too much because I already lost, like... 10 pounds, so that was me who lost 10 pounds, <laughs> not her. Set, let's go. One, good, babe. So, I guess we'll just do our workout at home tonight. <laughs> Maybe. All right, so we're headed to Costco's. We just left the gym. Baby's gonna get him some Beyond Burgers. Don't go shopping when you're hungry. Oh, I like bar soap, guys. This is Kirkland, and I usually don't do like store brand soap like this. But I'm going to try it. Praise God, you guys. Look at that sun just sunning on that good melanated skin over there. She's not feeling it, y'all. Because what happens is being pregnant, if, if, if my stomach is like that. And good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Ah, welcome back to another vlog. I am Sam Via. Thank you so much for tuning in. Welcome back to the Henry family. Just another day in the life, okay? It's going to be a homeschooling day, regular day, all of that good stuff. I did not sleep well, and I think that that's to be expected at this point. Like, getting comfortable in the bed is not it. Somebody said get a recliner. I have my nursing chair downstairs. I'm trying to see if I'm going to get ahead of sleeping now, but it's not as comfortable as I would hope. I think like the headrest on it is not high enough, so I don't think I'm going to use that. But anyway, you guys, I'm going to head to the gym, okay? I believe that even though you don't have the energy to work out, once you start working out, there's like a natural burst of energy that will come upon you. So I am searching for that today, okay? So this, I'm going to show y'all this cute outfit. I'm going to show y'all this cute outfit because my husband's like, but I got it from Target. I did a little Target haul last week and I picked this little bad boy up. I think I could have downsized a size. I got a large, probably could have did a medium. Naturally, I'm a small, but not carrying this load. So anyway, it's, it makes me feel a little bit like, I don't know, a little scurry, just a little short in the back, but it does have shorts underneath. So we will see, but um, everyone else is getting in the car. Everyone else already is dressed, ready, ate breakfast, all that good stuff. We have to go just about time for us to get out of here before we are too late for the kids zone. So let's go. Hey guys, hey, so we are headed to the Y right now and I do not like what I have on my lips. I don't even know what's on it. So I just put a little bit of this, mixed it with some gloss and yeah this can't i'm about to wipe this off because this is not looking no no it's a no for me so i'm about to take this off and just put some regular gloss on but i just needed some color and i don't have a towel but this is my gym towel but i'm gonna use it to take this off y'all because no that's not working hmm. now i don't like that like cloudy I don't like that cloudy color. And that's Lisa back there, always me mugging. All right, I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna put on my lips, guys. Okay, I have some lip liner, so maybe the lip liner can help. Let's see. That's a pen. Lip liner, let's see. All right, y'all, so I'm just gonna do it with you guys. And that looks a little dark too, but we're gonna just make it work, okay? We're gonna just make it work. The pink was too bright, so if I add some of this dark red, I like this color, but it's almost like a brown red. I, I, I typically like this color. Um, and of course, I'm not going to get it perfect because I'm trying to do it with one hand, hold the camera, and do this. So I'm trying.
it's gonna be fine okay it's just gonna be fine I have my Anastasia lipstick this is color uh, I don't know if I'm gonna like this I just need some color that's it nothing too light nothing too dark and I think that's just right so here we go headed to the gym all right you guys so we just made it to the gym oh and I'm getting out of the car everyone's getting out yeah. gotta pull down this little dress a little short little set because it's a little short headed to the gym now Go ahead, guys All right, guys, so we're inside waiting for the kids' zone. We're trying to check in right now. Say good morning, guys. Good morning. 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 But I just, I'm really feeling like I just don't want to. We're just gonna do it anyway. This is what we're doing today. All right, guys. So we're gonna just do a little bit of workout. Lisa's over here. She's trying to be in competition with me. I'm not really sure why, but that's just what she likes to do. Right, Lisa? Yes, that's what she likes to do, guys. I've been doing like 45 minutes on here already. I'm gonna after this, I'm gonna do some weight training and stuff like that. So just come for a ride. I just wanna let okay, y'all know. She said 45 minutes. I don't know what she's talking about. There's no 45 minutes. The thing only said a couple of seconds, but So we're just over here watching baby over here help Lou Antoine while he work out. And I'm just a camera girl, okay, you guys? I am not working out. I did a little bit of cardio, but I'm a little sore. And I know that I'm supposed to keep going. Like the soreness, I shouldn't let the soreness set in because I was working out yesterday, but y'all, I'm sore, okay? And that's all right, that's my business. So I'm just gonna be the camera girl. Let me go find Lisa, okay? I was trying to find you guys. What y'all doing, stretching? Okay, there's a little stretching area over there. Why are you guys gonna do that stretching thing? You, like behind that other wall is like stuff you can actually stretch with. Yeah. Yeah, sounds good. How was your workout? Good. What y'all do? I did with that ball, I did the thing. Uh huh. And then after that, I got the weight and pulled myself up and did that. Nice. And then I did the cardio. I did, you did? the stairs and stuff. That's good. What you do? I ran, I walked, I did squat thrust. Uh huh. I did um, overhand press. I did um, burpees. Um, I did this thing. Okay. Worked on your arms and stuff, shoulders. Okay, now. Sound good, girls. Yeah, I've been working out too. I worked out. I'm so tired. I did like 15 minutes on like. <laughs> no, that's not what I told you to do. What should I do? You squat down and then you push it up. You want to lose weight, don't you? <laughs> I do. <laughs> okay, ready? And push it up. Yeah. Exactly. And you guys can't see me because I have the dress on. 
but I'm sweating, man. I, I, you mean, I don't want to work out too much because I already lost like 10 pounds, so. That was me who lost 10 pounds, <laughs> not her. Oh my goodness. I just did a whole workout for this 50 minutes of working out. They over here working on their core. You guys are doing such a good job. Ready, set, let's go. One, good, two, three, not so fast, Lisa, four, five, six, come on, seven, Eight, nine, ten. Good job. Yay. Good job. How does that feel? <laughs> Good job. I told you I was a camera girl, so making sure I get everybody's footage, okay? Before we go and get those other babies, okay? <laughs> Babe, so I guess we'll just do our workout at home tonight? Maybe. <laughs> you can't slam it down. And that's our cue to go because Austin is having difficulties following some directions downstairs in the kids' zone. So that's our cue to go. But we had a great time. I had a great talk with this man over here. Uh, this little dress that I got on. He's trying to show all his goodies. I'm going to work out tonight. <laughs> You're going to work out tonight? Yeah. Is that, is, that a, is that a threat or a promise? <laughs> oh. Don't give it up. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're going to get the kids, y'all. Thank you. Thank you. So we are here, you guys. We are walking out. Probably going to go to Publix and get some more deli meat because we had sandwiches yesterday. That stuff was good. And it was so yummy, you guys. We were going to go ahead and buy deli sandwiches from Publix, but after doing my mathematics calculation, I realized that it was more cost effective for us to buy our own deli meat, our own bread, own baguettes, little heroes, whatever they call it. And we did it ourselves and y'all, it was so good. So I think that's what we're gonna do today for lunch. It's lunch time. So we are headed out and about to load up in this car. So we'll see you guys soon. Bye. All right, so we're headed to Costco's. We just left the gym. Can you put these away for me, please? Thank you. Um, and we are headed to Costco's. And listen, I, I know. It feels like we've been living at Costco's these last few days. Just because we've been going to Costco's literally like every other day in the last seven days. But let me tell you, I, I can explain, okay? Um, we went to Costco's on Sunday after we came back from our football game. And I saw a big pot of potting soil. And it was huge, and it was for $7.99. I think the original price probably was like $9.99, but it was like $2 less. But when I tell you this bag was gigantic. And so I was like, oh, I should get that. And once we left, I did not get it. And so here it is a couple of days later, and I was like, wait a minute. I need that soil so for our garden beds. So instead of me just going to home depot or walmart and going to get a big bag of potting soil i'm going back to costco's because I, it's not that far of a distance so i'm just going to get ahead and go to costco's and grab what i need and then we're going to go to Publix get some more deli meat so we can make our sandwiches again for lunch and so we can start our garden bed so i'm really excited to take you guys on that journey and just to really show you guys how we do things now this i'm a this is my disclaimer because this is going to be the first time that we actually do a raised garden bed before when we lived in the other house we did a whole huge like garden in our backyard and it was huge we had watermelon cucumber tomato peppers we had squash zucchini it was so good and when i tell you the weeds started coming up and it was just so hard to like maintain but it was really nice we had it for like the whole like spring and i say summer because we started it off in march and all of our stuff started growing right around like june july and so we had like a nice size watermelon i'm going if i find photos i'm going to um post 
post it up for you guys so you guys can see the photos of our previous garden that we did it was it was magnificent I think it was just overall like a wonderful experience like the kids was like we didn't like having to turn over the grass we had to like literally turn over the grass because we had a whole like spot where it was just grass so we had to like turn it over we went to Home Depot my husband rented um, one of those machines so oh I'm, I'm dropping y'all I'm sorry he uh, rented one of those machines so he can turn over the, the yard the grass so we can be able to just have soil it was it was an amazing process so if I find some photos I don't think I was recording back then but if I find some, I'm going to show you guys, okay? So I went back and I actually found some photos. So right now we were just turning over the soil. And right now we had a whole lot of sand and stuff. But we then planted and we were just waiting. And then we got some stuff, y'all. That's some radishes and a watermelon. Baby, smile. <laughs> had to make him smile. All right, guys, so we're going ahead and going into Costco's right now so we can get our soil really quick, really quick. Oh, my pot and soil. Oof. Oh, my gosh, I'm old or something. Got our stuff, you guys. It just smells a little bad over here. And, you know, me with my little pregnancy nose and sinuses and all that stuff. Be, my stomach be weak. But yay, look at that big old bag, y'all. This big old bag. Oh, it smells so bad over here. I gotta move, baby. $7.99. Baby's gonna get him some Beyond Burgers. Yay! Nice. Hubby is not eating meat, you guys. And if you guys are wondering why he's looking sad these days, that's the reason why. <laughs> I'm not sad at all. Right, no, no. We just heard him. He just made he's I'm not sad because of that. <laughs> He's hungry, y'all. Look, look what I just picked up. Like, don't go shopping when you're hungry. Oh, this is lobster, though. This right. Lobster, I'm thinking it's regular, like ravioli. Oh, it's spinach ravioli right there. Go get the yeah, spinach one. Yeah, spinach one. So this is main lobster ravioli, and I got some juicy like crab boil at home. I'm gonna put this in it, y'all. Don't come shopping while you're hungry. So hubby's about to get this. What you got, honey? He got the spinach and cheese. So he gonna get this one, that's gonna be good. I typically stick to like, I like bar soap guys for my kids is too. And this is Kirkland and I usually don't do like store brand soap like this, but I'm gonna try it. Let me know in the comments. Have you guys ever tried this? I'm gonna try it and we're gonna see how it goes. All right, y'all, baby just got us some samples. <laughs> you got me two of them? Okay, I can't hold two. Uh oh, y'all got me some samples. Yeah, that tastes good, y'all. That tastes good. It's some like boom boom popcorn. It's like caramel, sweet, and then like salty. It tastes really good. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. So we're all done. Oh, you can go ahead, baby. Okay. Got everything we need. Praise God, you guys. Look at that sun just sunning on that good melanated skin over there. But we just made it back home, so we're about to unload this car with all of our stuff we're gonna get some lunch and then we're gonna get started on our garden bed so we are back home we are back home so um i know a lot of you was like talking about this dress and i'm just like if you don't like it just say that but trying to give me opinions on what i should wear versus what you will wear and versus what a christian woman will wear i mean the christian woman guidelines is given by the world and the society it's like keep your comments to yourself like why are we having co i tell my kids that all the time i'm teaching them how to have like you know because kids don't have a filter so i'm teaching them how to have a filter and how to refrain from certain saying you know just insensitive things to people but to talk about it to with grown folks it's almost like y'all too grown for this y'all too grown for this now we'll put a disclaimer up because this is not for everyone i love y'all but it's for the ones that had something nasty and negative to say and who felt the need to question whether or not i was a christian woman y'all 
are to grow for that. Anyway, but you, I love it though because it's so engagement, right? But let's continue to go on. Um, washing my hands. We're going, I'm going to put this food away. And then I'm going to pick up baby Leia because I can hear her. I think she's hungry. She's teething. So she's not really feeling too good. So I'm about to pick her up right now before I even put this food away. To let her know, like, mommy hears you. I hear you. Mommy hears you, Leia. feeling it y'all. Bea, did you see a banana? You want some banana? You want banana? You want banana? Yeah? Would you like a banana? I don't want my stomach to be, I don't want to have an upset stomach too. Like right now, like I've, I've been having an upset stomach because my body is moving, my bowels are moving. And I've been taking that Marilix and stuff like that. So my bowels are moving. So I don't want to take something that's going to just cause me to have, because what happens is being pregnant, if, if, if my stomach is like that and it can't come out, then where it's going, it's coming up. And I don't want to be vomiting this stuff out. So I know that me taking that, I can even feel it now, it's going to make me vomit. Whereas this, let this do the stuff on the outside. This is 15 minutes to an hour. If I don't go in an hour, then I know I can go ahead and take this. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want you putting it on my butt. And so you just open it up and you just put it up there. Get out of that car. Mom! Mom, look! Yeah. 